Good morning, boys. Today's episode is presented by the Printworks Final Boss. That's what you've all been calling me because of my highlight atop, my trash taste in music and the chain. I'm about to go to the gym and it's going to be the first time in three weeks that I've actually been able to train properly, so I'm going to go very hard. Let's get a little start up. I really need to leave right now. This is not good. Maybe if I put the windows up, um, I'll pretend I can't hear it. The neighbours definitely love me. Okay, that's a good 30 pounds down from pre-operation. Sick. Adequate meal deal has been secured. Fridge Raiders, chicken and bacon sarnie, British classic, mate. An innocent... No, it ain't. It's a naked smoothie. Everything's better naked, mate. Bro clearly wants my sandwich. <laughs> yeah, piss off, mate. Big up my bro. He's going to be cooking dinner tonight. Yeah, I'm sure I'm going to get the salmonella. <laughs> <laughs> I've got something really, really cool to show you, boys. I don't think that you're ready for this. Are you ready? All right. Look at that, mate. Don't you think that's pretty cool? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm off to a wedding, so uh, I had to get a suit, so I thought I'd go with a pink one, because it's more interesting. What are you doing? Kai, why did you say just leave it? Because there's nothing we can do. <laughs> And not only that, but look at the state of what he's cooking. It's fine. <laughs> but that's fine. All right, crisis averted. The fire has been put out. So it is now time to do some setups for some new clients. Ain't that right, little mush? Huh? Look at her face. I don't know why this dog loves eating mud. She's literally a fiend for it. She's an addict. This is what I spend the majority of my day doing. It's check-ins for clients, talking to clients, form checks, all of that stuff. Um, and obviously, if you want to be coached by myself, the link is down below. Your first check-in day is Sunday. Let's smash the first week, mate. You get swole. What I mean is Lamborghinis, big mansion and birds in bikinis. Oh, it's definitely done. It's you reckon it's done? Well, the pan's burned, so probably. <laughs> <laughs> Bro's a chef. <laughs> taste test. Only one way to describe it. Um, drier than a nun in a cucumber field. Evan's trying to put some LED lights in the footwell of his car. Classic modification. <laughs> The birds are gonna love that, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> birds are gonna be absolutely creaming, my guy. <laughs> right, well, what do you need help with? Because that's literally working. With the carbon fiber wrap, bro. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. <laughs> Should we go for a drive? Bro, I'm trying to, I'm business in it here. I'm doing bits to the car. You're doing bits to your car? Is that not automotive sexual? <laughs> You're really in the <laughs> So these two little bits. See if you can get them to come off first. No, we don't need them to come off. Kai, you can place it on there and use the little... I'm sure you want me to do this? Bro, just don't mess it up and it's fine. Bro, there's no wrinkles at all. This is perfect. I know, right? What are those wrinkles, Kai? Bro's got carbon fibre. How have you managed to get wrinkles like that on it, though? How do you feel about that? I'm now taking bookings for wrapping services, so if you want anything like this done, give me a bell. You happy with the result? <laughs> so happy, man. I could cry. It's amazing. <laughs> Sick. Next up, <laughs> circumcision. <laughs> Good morning, boys. It's now the next day. I thought I'd take these little cretins for a walk before uh, I go to the gym to hit legs for the first time properly since the operation. Uh, slightly scared, but also kind of gassed. I want to thrust some weight, mate. Who the fuck are you? I've been really enjoying my uh, early morning walks recently because it gets rid of all my stress at the beginning of the day, which is very nice. Uh, gets me in the mood for work, which is very good because busy day today, check-in day for my clients. So excited to get that going. Um, but first, of course, I've got to get this leg session 
under Weymouth. Not again. The neighbours really aren't going to like me. Oh my god. Every time I get into the car, Ed Sheeran automatically comes on. I'm going to be hearing this song in my nightmares, mate. I swear to God. The pre of the day, Cola Bottle Alpha Pre. It's literally just come out within the past 10 minutes. Um, taste test. Oh, that is ridiculous. Literally does taste like Cola Bottles. Obviously, I wasn't expecting it to taste like piss. You already know, Kokai. I remember I posted this meal on my story once and was saying how high calorie it is and someone was like, that's not very high calorie, 150 grams ain't much. Yeah mate, it's a lot of cornflakes. The thing is with cornflakes, it's really easy to get them down. They're just one of those things where I can just continue to munch it. I won't tell you what the other things I can always munch are. Hello bro, you have now been with me for officially 12 weeks. Look at the difference between what you're looking like now and uh, when you joined up. That's just insane. I'm off to Cyprus in probably about like two days when you end up actually seeing this video, so I'm actually quite excited for that. I haven't been on holiday properly in about, I don't know, like nearly a year? There is a gym nearby though, so the grind will not be stopping. I've got myself a car so I'm actually able to get about the island and train and actually do some really cool stuff. It is about nine o'clock right now and I've just finished work for the day and I'm thinking like, what do I do for the last hour before I go to sleep? Because I'm not seeing the bird tonight. Um, so like, what the do I do, bro? Turns out I do have something to do and that's obviously eating again. Genuinely, the amount that I'm eating on this bulk is just obscene. It's ridiculous, five meals a day, I'm pushing myself harder than I've ever pushed myself before. One thing I have noticed is since I've been taking the bulk super seriously and the online coaching has grown like crazy, I don't have that much time to myself anymore. Which is obviously bad in some ways, but in other ways it's actually kind of good. Because you know when you're kind of like bored and don't really have much to do, you've got so much time to get into your own head and like think about being sad and all this crap, but like I literally don't have time for any of that. So. I'm actually in a significantly better mood the majority of the time than I would otherwise be. Don't get me wrong, I'm not one of these like, I'm on my sigma grind. <sighs> Pussies. Um, but like, I am working hard, I'm training hard, and I'm uh, doing other things hard. And stuff's going well. Very, very happy. I think I can hear a flock of geese going by. Also, a little tip for when you're cooking your eggs. You know when the whole thing is hard apart from like, this little white bit on the top. There's a way to solve it and I'm not gonna gatekeep. I'm gonna show you. It's this. Slap a lid on that bad boy and you're sorted. It keeps all the steam in and it actually like cooks the top. So there's Kai's tip. And there we go. Some perfect smegs on toast. Before I go though, coaching is in the description if you wanna get coached by me. Peace.